Hello everyone and welcome to Unity News, or how I like to call it Unity Breaking News. So the first topic that I would like to cover is the release of Death in the Water 2. And this is a game by Lighthouse Game Studios, done with the Unity engine. We can have a look at it. Yeah, uh, this game looks fantastic in my opinion. So you can have a look, uh, have a look at it. It's available on Steam. I got the information regarding this game through the Unity blog, uh, actually from the latest Made with Unity monthly uh, post. So if you don't know Unity blog, you should definitely check it out. It has some cool information that may interest you. So next, I'm going to show you the publisher of the week, uh, which is Astrofish Games. You can get this awesome asset at minus 50% from the asset store. And yeah, I think this guy really creates awesome looking assets. So definitely check it out if you want to make some stylized game. And the next I would like to show you is the newest update regarding iStep uh, which is going to be version 1.3.3 and in this version there will be something included uh, which is called pull down extrapolation by the way i hope this update is going to be released next week uh, it depends on unity how long it will take until it's live anyway so this pull down extrapolation i will show you how it used to look if i if i disable it so you will see the character floating a little bit on very steep slopes. So to get rid of that, uh, this parameter can be used now. And the feet will be way better connected to the ground uh, like that. And the good thing about this parameter here is that you don't have to increase the stiffness. So your character can still stay as smooth as before while uh, improving uh, how good the feet and the legs uh, align to the ground. So this is really a very nice improvement in my opinion. And yeah, you will be able to get this update uh, hopefully next week. So that's the news for iStep. So last but not least, I'm going to show you some new stuff from Hoax News. I'm not going to show you every new thing because most of the new things are going to be covered uh, in the next devlog. But I'm going to show you this. So what is that? That's a hoax news. <laughs> yeah, you hear right. I'm calling this hoax news. And this now is the moon hoax. Or oh, it's one part of the moon hoax. So what is this about? Did you know that Buzz Aldrin, one of the crew members of Apollo 11, basically confessed in an interview that they never went there, to the moon? You can check out the full interview here. So definitely search this interview on YouTube. And these are the points of interest, but the most inter uh, interesting point you will find at 710. Uh, check it out. It's it's really super super interesting. Just Google uh, or search in YouTube Zoe interviews Buzz Eldrin. It's really interesting. So I wanted to show this to you uh, There's one other thing That has been included here which is some small destruction Nothing groundbreaking, but still very nice destruction. And yeah, the rest I'm going to show you at the devlog. And yeah, thank you for watching and see you next time.